Hey friends, this is the Miss Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead. Don't look at my hair, I just got out of the shower. And today, we're going to make broccoli cheese bacon pie. Now this is really simple, folks. You're going to need a double pie shell, obviously. You're going to need a cup of bachamel sauce or two cups of bachamel sauce. We'll make that in a minute. The main ingredients are two cups of shredded sharp cheddar. Shred it yourself, folks. Don't buy that stuff that's got wood pulp in it. About a cup of cubed bacon. You can use ham, but I'm using bacon. A cup and a half of onion. And about three cups of broccoli. Let's get started. All right, first, we want to start sauteing. This is obviously is my homestead bacon. If you can get thick cut bacon, it would be best. So we're gonna start this stuff sauteing together while we make our bachamel sauce. Bachamel sauce is real easy. Two tablespoons of butter, a couple of tablespoons of flour. You're gonna want this somewhat thick because your broccoli is going to give off a lot of liquid. So we're just going to melt these together. We want to brown the flour. We want to kind of cook this flour. Now this is just the simple version, folks. You can add whatever vegetables you want, whatever meat you want. You can make it your own. But I bought a big bag of broccoli at Costco, and I noticed some of the florets were getting yellow around the edges, so I've got to use it up. Now to that, we're going to add about two cups of milk. And we're just going to stir this until it's thickened. And we're going to saute our bacon and onions until they're half done. And then we'll meet you guys at the table. Okay, so here we have our broccoli, our cheese, our bachamel sauce, our lightly sauteed bacon and onion, and our two dough balls of pastry. So let's get our pie together. Now folks, if you're a vegetarian, by all means, leave out the meat. It's not a huge issue. If you want to know how to make my flaky pastry, there's the link right there. Here is the bottom half of the shell. Get this into the pie plate. Now let's start with the broccoli. Got to break these up. Papa doesn't like big chunks of broccoli. Took me years to get him to eat broccoli to begin with. And we're going to put in a layer of our onion and bacon saute and a layer of the grated sharp cheddar. Now if you don't have sharp cheddar, all you have is mild, go ahead and use it. Add some Parmesan. Add some blue cheese. Like I said, make it your own. Now I'm going to keep the cheese in the center. Why? Because I don't want it sticking to the pastry. Get the rest of the broccolis on here. We're going to gently just kind of press this down a bit. The rest of our onions and bacon. Let's set this aside for a second. Okay. Okay. Now we're going to do three cuts, for vent, two for vents, and one because, well, that's the way my mom taught me. And we're going to set this aside. Now let's take our lovely pie, poke some holes, just to make sure our bachamel is going to get down in and around that broccoli. And here is our wonderful creamy bachamel sauce. Now let's pour it real slow folks. We don't want it overflowing the pie. Some more pepper for Papa. And we're going to put our top on. degree oven for 45 minutes. We'll see you guys at the All dinner. Alright, let's cut daddy a piece. Isn't that just the prettiest pastry? Look at how flaky that is.
it may have fallen apart taking it out of the pit, but look at the flakiness of this pastry. Try some broccoli with your cheese mm, sauce bacon. there. Is that bacon? Bacon, onion. Mm -hmm. um, good pie, Papa? It's very good. Awesome. It's all good. This is the Mrs. Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead saying, Got lots of broccoli? Make a pie. Thank <laughs> you.